I'm Jay Kill. And my name is Josh Shea. And, and these, these are, are our first concerts! <laughs> <laughs> my first concert, it was actually OzFest in 2007. It was like Ozzy Osbourne, um, like Static X, and a bunch of other bands and stuff. All I remember is that we were in the lawn section and there were like, like bottles being flown and stuff. So my uncle actually ended up talking to one of the people and I got to see Ozzy Osbourne from like right behind the pit in like the seating area. And it was really cool. And Zach Wilde did like a 12 minute long guitar solo of the Star Spangled Banner. Uh, but yeah, it was it was sick, and that like uh, pretty much made me want to be a musician ever since I saw that. And here I am. When, whenever I was I was a kid, like about seven years old, I started learning how to play the guitar. I learned from like listening to like Slipknot, and uh, um, the first song I like fully knew how to play was Crazy Train. And uh, I got to I got to go to Ozfest because like my uncle was a huge Ozzy fan, and he showed me like Metallica and all that stuff. And uh, from there. Um, he, he just like he surprised me with tickets and I went with him and it was pretty cool and uh, Yeah, it was just cool to see Ozzy in in person in the flesh And I also saw Dio too before he died. It was like a week before he died my first most memorable show um, There were a couple that I went to back when I was like 14 But I don't really take away anything from those it was like it started out with we the Kings when I was like 14 They came to my little tiny no-name town of all places, but um the biggest one which was like I consider it my first show. It was Parkway Drive. I had always been in Parkway Drive had always been my favorite band since I was like 16. Then when I was 20, I went to Atlanta and saw Parkway Drive at the the original Masquerade with the super bouncy floors. The intro to uh, their Atlas album, I can't remember the name. I cried. I was so overwhelmed because I'd wanted to see them for so long. And it was just the fucking best first show experience ever. Um, I got to scream "Carry On" for the first time. I'd always wanted to do that. And then from then on, it went to like, uh, <clears throat> I went to every show I could within like a four, four hour radius because I lived in like a no name shitty town in Alabama, so I'd have to drive to Atlanta all the time. From then on, it went to like Emir. Uh, I saw Reflections at some shitty bar in Pensacola. I think it was their last tour, actually. The last metal show I went to was, um, I think, Knock Loose when they came to Atlanta. But yeah, man, that Parkway Drive show just kind of made me be like, damn, I want to do this shit. I didn't know I'd be doing it as a rapper, but here I am. 